Hey everyone, One Big Boss here, and well, the 90s are back. And as you can tell, we're doing a rundown video of Marvel vs. Capcom Origins, the trailer anyway. Uh, it's pretty much um, talking about, you know, well, it's, it's showing what we've already expected from this. We're going to get online play. Both games, both magnificent games from the 90s, are now brought back to us in HD. They're going to be downloadable for the Xbox Live and the PlayStation 3 in September, and I cannot wait. Um, these were two of my favorite fighting games growing up, and I also liked X-Men vs. Street Fighter as well. That was when I played in the arcade a lot. But these two games were just amazing. My buddies and I played these all the time. And my friends were all like, Boss, why are you so hyped up for this game? Didn't you just come back from Florida with Marvel vs. Capcom 1 that you found in a store for $10 pretty much brand new? And I was like, yes, I did. But the fact of it is, this game's got online play, so I can play with my other friends who enjoy Marvel games, or my buddies that have moved away or in the military, we can all play this together. So, I want to know if this game's been patched up and fixed, because I know that Marvel vs. Capcom 1 is kind of broken. I'm not sure how bad uh, Marvel Super Heroes is, honestly. I don't remember how broken if it was. But my question to you, the people, if they're going to be doing this, what game would you like to see come out next for a download HD? Personally, my choice would be X-Men vs. Street Fighter because when I played the original Marvel superheroes, I was hooked on that game. It was in the bowling alley uh, that I used to go to every Saturday with my friends because we had a bowling team. And after every day, well, after every bowling Saturday, we would go and play Marvel superheroes. And then at one point, they had put X-Men vs. Street Fighter in there and they kept both things and we kept switching back and forth. We used to challenge people for quarters in the arcade. It was amazing. It was Two amazing games, so I wouldn't mind having an HD port of them, honestly. Next up would be, an, I would choose Marvel Super Heroes vs. Street Fighter, because I had played, uh, I've honestly played those that one for a long time, too, because when those machines got so old and they shipped them out of the uh, the bowling alley, we didn't have them anymore. So the another arcade in the next town next to me, uh, they had actually had this game there, and I didn't know it had existed. I, I didn't know about it. I didn't see it in any magazines and stuff, so... Me and my buddies went in there, because we used to play the the old X-Men uh, arcade cabinet they, they had there, and then we saw this one day, and I was thinking to myself, wow, that actually looks pretty fun. It looks a lot like X-Men vs. Street Fighter, and we, you know, we, we, pop, we popped our coins in, and we, we got hooked. I played it for a lot longer, and I used to challenge people there all the time. It was amazing. I loved it, and if it gets an HD port, you know, I fully support it. I would love to see an HD port of this game, because it's just, it's just amazing. That does it for episode 5 of the rundown, everybody. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you'd like to see as an HD port from games, whether it be PS1, Dreamcast, what would you like to see come to the Xbox Live and the PSN? Would it be more fighters? Let me know. Uh, just leave a comment below and I'll get back to you on that. Uh, honestly, I'm very excited about this game. This is my childhood. The 90s is coming back and all. So, yeah, as always, please subscribe because it's free. In this day and age, free is a damn good thing. And you can bet when September comes around, I'll have a full review for you all. So until then, I'll see you all next time.